right, guys, I am super excited. I just have enough time to talk about these today because I am heading out at 4 o'clock to see the new Ghostbusters Afterlife movie. I cannot wait. Today, Spirit has put four more animatronics for sale on their site. We're going to be right back, and we're going to talk about those. I told you to stay away. Oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, so yes, I am so excited. Let's go to the Spirit Halloween website here, and the first thing that pops up, it says Merry, Bright, and Full of Fright Shop Animatronics. And we have a picture of one of the new ones that just showed up on here today. Now, I don't know how new this actually is, and honestly, I gotta get going to the movie here pretty soon, so I don't have time to do a lot of research on them. But this is the first time that I have seen this one available. The six foot hooded phantom animatronic. Let's take a look at this thing. And then we have three more that they also just put on there that we're going to look at as well. Okay, the six foot phantom animatronic, $279.99. This thing immediately made me think of the Wraith, only the Wraith is white, the phantom is black. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Here's the first picture. Let's look at the pictures real quick. It looks like he has no face. It's just like an open area there where his face would be. It looks like his hands and his face light up. I have not watched the video yet, but I'm just kind of going by what I see in the pictures here. That thing looks super spooky. So let's go ahead and look at the video here. Okay. Your time on this earth has come to an end. I have come for your soul. Whether you sing with the choir invisible or wail with the demons of the underworld, I care not. Your soul is mine. Hmm. Okay, I don't know why they make these videos so short on here. Why they don't let you hear like all of the, um, the phrases that these animatronics say. But this one, we only were able to hear one phrase. It was kind of a long one, and he speaks in almost a monotone voice. Very hush, and it's it's still super spooky. Definitely is spooky. Um, but that is the six-foot hooded phantom animatronic. Did I call it the Phantom Menace or something earlier? I don't know why Phantom Menace pops in my head. I think that's Star Wars. <laughs> Anyways, um, so, okay, let's hop back. I'm looking forward to seeing other people's videos who actually purchased this uh, this animatronic, and I want to see what all he says. So let's go on to the next one. The next one is a seven-foot cellar dweller. Now, I remember years ago there was a cellar dweller animatronic that was just, uh, I think it was called the, the cellar dweller. In fact, let's take a look at it here. Okay, yeah, I found it here, and yes, it's called cellar dweller. It was from 2008, and it's just a pair of cellar doors, and I believe they just kind of rattle. That's like the only thing that they do. Kind of spooky, but let's go ahead and take a look at that video quick here. That's all that one does. It's just a pair of cellar doors and they rattle and you hear like ghosts or goblins or whatever, some kind of monsters down inside. That is a totally different cellar dweller than what this one is. This one is a seven foot ghoul. <laughs> all right, look at this thing. He is super tall, super spooky. Let's just look at the pictures here for a minute. Looks like he has this green moss and stuff hanging from him. There's a bunch of that stuff hanging outside my window here on trees. I'm in Florida right now. Um, let's go ahead and watch the video for this guy. This dank old house is oozing with the foul stench of rotten souls. It's kept me thriving as long as I hide down here with the rats. I'm happy to share with you if you have the stomach for it. <laughs> Okay, now that was a little bit longer than I expected, actually. A lot of these have been really, really short. That was pretty cool. His voice is totally spooky. 
I hope we get to see him in some stores. I don't think we're going to get to, but you never know what will show up. I've been to, man, I don't know, got to be close to 100 stores already. And you never know what's going to show up in these stores. So let's hop back here for a minute and go on to the next one. I'm excited about this one. This one is called Prowling Jack. He is also seven feet tall. Let's open this up here. Ginormous skeleton. Actually, the face on this one looks a lot like the collector. I love the collector, man. All right. I'm not really digging the face that's on that pumpkin, but let's wait till we see the video here to do too much judging. I do love this picture of him, how he's so tall and he's just hanging over, well, just like, I don't even know what to call it. He's just like lunging forward. And it makes me wonder, like, is he seven feet tall up where his back lunges over? Or is he seven foot tall and then he lunges? I don't know, we're gonna find out in the video here. It looks like that's just how he stands. So let's go ahead and watch this video. I'm excited about this one. I love this time of year when the air is cold and the veil to the afterlife is at its thinnest. Yes, I can hear the voices of the spirits calling out to be released. And the souls of the living are so bright and vibrant to our eyes like beacons in the night. Let's tear open the veil and release our brethren unto the world. Yes, oh this God. night shall be ours. Let the feast begin. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I absolutely love it. All right, now, like I said, I'm not really digging the face that they have on the pumpkin, the whole shape and everything. It looks kind of generic, but man, was that awesome. He talks first, and he sounds just like the Collector. So he talks first, and then the Pumpkin talks, and then him, and then the Pumpkin again, and then they both laugh together. How cool was that? That is definitely one of my favorite all-time animatronics right there. That guy is awesome. And just the fact that he's seven feet tall it just tops it off. That I absolutely love that guy. He is my favorite out of all these so far. And we only have one left which this, this thing is not gonna take first place for me. Um, six foot lunging reaper. Let's open this up. Immediately it makes me think of um, hugs because hugs lunges. So I'm kind of wondering if this isn't just like a redressed hugs body. Um, let's look at the pictures here. Looks like a female grim reaper maybe. Pretty spooky looking. Yeah, I do like the looks of it. Um, okay, let's go ahead and watch the video here. I have come to guide one of you into the afterlife. I guess it's come not a chick, it's a dude. And meet your fate. <laughs> Don't okay. worry. I will return for you soon enough. All right, I mean kind of uneventful and especially after that last one that I am absolutely blown away with this one really isn't all that great it's still cool still looks awesome I thought it was a girl <laughs> by the way it looks but then when he starts talking it's definitely a guy so six foot lunging reaper he's two seventy nine ninety nine. let's go back here for a minute and look at the price of the other ones Man, Prowling Jack is 450 bucks. Dang. That's a lot of money for an animatronic. However, he was awesome. I absolutely love that one. The seven foot cellar dweller is 349. I don't think that pr I think that price is way too high for that guy. Um, six foot hooded phantom is 279. He's pretty awesome, too. If I ever bought him, I would definitely have to get the Wraith, too, so they could be, like, one on each side of the house, just swaying around and being spooky. But, uh, but yeah, out of these four guys, um, Prowling Jack definitely takes it for me. That guy is so cool. We gotta watch him one more time, because he is just way too cool, man. I'm probably gonna watch this video a hundred times. I love it. I love this time of year. When the air is cold, and the veil to the afterlife is at its thinnest. Yes, 
I can hear the voices of the spirits calling out to be released. And the souls of the living are so bright and vibrant to our eyes, like beacons in the night. Let's tear open the veil and release our brethren unto the world. Yes, this night shall be ours. Let the feast begin. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, he's so perfect. I love it so much. And the pumpkin, even though I said I didn't like it in the beginning, he's already growing on me. He is so hilarious. Let's tear open the veil. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to call it a day on this video. I got to get ready to go to the movie. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I do, and I hope they keep putting more animatronics on here. If they do, I'll be back with more videos. Until then, make sure you're subscribed, give me a thumbs up and a comment below, and I will see you guys in the next video.